GitHub makes it easy to add a license to an existing repository. They include templates for a number of common licenses and will walk you through the entire process. Now you can see that my current repository does not have a license, and that's no good because if somebody is wanting to use the code, it's unclear if they would be able to. Now to get started adding a license, I'm just gonna go and click on add file over here, and I'm gonna say create new file. Now for the file name, I'm going to type in license in all uppercase. So I'll say license, all uppercase, and instead of typing anything down here, I'm going to instead say choose license template. Now you can see that GitHub is listing off a bunch of common licenses over here. So we have the Apache license, for example, and if we click on it at the top, we can see a bunch of information about the license. You can see the permissions, the limitations, and then you can actually go and learn more about it if you wanted to. And if we scroll down a little bit, you can actually see the license text that would be added. Let's go and select the MIT license. And again, you can see the various permissions and limitations of the license, and then the license text. Now, in the case of the MIT license, it also is going to fill in some template data. So you can see here the year and full name. Those are going to get pulled in from the sidebar over here. So if I wanted to, I can go and change this, and it would uh, be replaced with the current uh, information that I filled in in the sidebar. I'm just going to put that back to 2022, and then say review and submit once everything looks good. Now you can see that we're back in that create new file view, but GitHub has gone and filled in all of the information here for the license. So it's inserted the license text into this file. To go and actually add this to my repository, I'm going to scroll down here, and I'm going to go and select commit directly to the main branch. By committing directly to main, it's going to check in the license directly instead of creating a pull request to go and add it. So I'll say commit new file. And now I've successfully added my license file to the repository. You can see that GitHub is also tagging the repository as having the MIT license, and it'll be much clearer to anybody that stumbles across this repo how they can use the code.